-hmm. Let's get into this video. <laughs> Oh, hey, <laughs> thank you for tuning in to another video. My name is Janelle. Welcome to my channel. I have an Instagram and I also have a Twitter. So if you are interested in seeing what I post and all that good stuff, make sure that you check out the links in the description. Now we're going to get straight into this video. We're going to be talking about menstrual pads. Listen, I got my period when I was around 11 years old. Okay. And my mother introduced me to the brand Always. And so since I was 11, I've been using Always pads. And, you know, later, years, years later, I eventually started using tampons. And um, I believe I was using the brand Tampax. But we're not talking about tampons. We're talking about pads. So when I was growing up, you know, I was wearing pads. And at nighttime, I would wear you know, longer ones because I had a heavy flow and I never changed it. I just always used always, even though so many different brands came out, I always stuck with always. <laughs> but because I started becoming more health conscious and, you know, really looking into the brands, into the ingredients and all that, when it came to my body, not only did I make the switch to my natural hair products without any you know silicones and parabens and i also made the switch from an aluminum based deodorant to an aluminum free deodorant i went from the brand always which is a big you know brand to a small black owned business by the name of the honey pot company so being more health conscious, I wanted to just stop using everything that I was using as a child, as a kid, as an adolescent, and then just start fresh. So changing the brand of pads I started using definitely made a difference. So let's talk about the ingredients. When it comes to the ingredients, these pads have cotton, rose, mint, aloe, lavender, Okay, these are all great ingredients. Why? Because the lavender, it calms inflammation and minimizes discomfort. The rose, it tones and reduces inflammation. The aloe vera soothes and heals irritated skin. And then the mint gives you that cool and refresh soreness or pain. If you've ever had really bad cramps, if you're in pain, you don't want to feel nothing dry down there, okay? You want your yoni to feel nice and fresh. Do you agree? Do you agree? Because I know I want my yoni to feel nice and fresh, okay? So, with that being said, the, the ingredients in these pads are just amazing. Now, these pads... They all come in different sizes. They have postpartum pads. I will show you a picture more so because unfortunately I used up all the pads. So I have to re-up. The only ones I have on hand today is the regular and the super, which I have already used. So while I show you this picture, let me just talk a little bit about the different pads that you know, the brand offers. So they have postpartum pads. They have regular pads. They have super pads. They have overnighters. And then they have everyday panty liners. So this is what the packaging looks like. The Honey Pop Company, regular herbal infused, herbal, <laughs> herbal infused pads with wings, mint, lavender, aloe. And it tells you mint is for cooling. Lavender's for calming and aloe is for soothing. No chlorine, no pesticides, no fragrances. Plant-based feminine care, 20 count. The teardrop for use on your period. So the ingredients, it also has it right there. Absorbency, you can trust without all the chemicals. And that's, I feel like that is 
one of the reasons why I really love this brand so much. It's not about the fact that, okay, it gives me a nice cooling sensation. It's about what they stand for. And they, they provide those clean ingredients that you can actually read. Four or five ingredients, that's enough for me. That is enough for me. Um, <laughs> one thing I love, one thing I also love is that it says, made by humans with vaginas for humans with vaginas because it takes one to know one. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The person who created this has a vagina so that she knows what we go through. Um... And just a little bit of background about her. It says, I was suffering with bacterial vaginosis for eight months when an ancestor came to me in a dream and gifted me with a vision to heal myself. With her help, I created the honey pot to solve for what other brands wouldn't through the power of herbs. So this brand is definitely great. I definitely recommend it. Comfortable, confident, and clean. Yes, yes, and yes. So, the packaging is the same throughout. Um, it tells you, you know, the ingredients. Uh, it has the mint lavender aloe on it. Um, it has the different teardrops on it. The, you know, the level of menstrual cycle that, you know, you have. So, the regular has two teardrops and then the super has three teardrops out of the four. So I'm going to open up one of the supers just to really give you guys something to, to look at if you have it. So this is the super. Now, granted, I know. Oh, it's thin. I know it's thin, but this is what it looks like. And okay. All of them have wings except the panty liners. So as you can see, you pull away this little tab, you have your wings and then you, you know, you put it under your, on the bottom part of your, your panties and you're good to go. In my history of using pads, we have the panty liners, which you use at the end of your menstrual cycle or, you know, on an everyday basis, depending on your preference. Then we have regular which I use, you know, a couple days after my flow, my menstrual cycle started, you know, when my flow isn't so heavy. The overnights, when I use overnight in the beginning of my menstrual cycle, because that is when the flow is the heaviest. And then we have the super. So, you know, sometimes even during the day, you have a heavy flow, you want to use super to just protect that. Now, one of the things that caught me off guard about these pads is that they are thin. They are not super thick like the always pads. They are thinner. So this is the super. You may think it's not thick, but it is. Okay. So yes, this is thick compared to the overnight and the postpartum, but it catches the flow. Now, don't just take my word for it. Try it out for yourself. Okay, keep in mind, you will have that cooling sensation. Okay, you may not be expecting it, but it's there. And I feel like you will come to like it. And one thing I would say is that surprisingly, it really holds a lot of flow. <laughs> okay, it holds a lot of flow. So the first time I started using these pads was after I had my son, I started with the postpartum because clearly I was pregnant. I never used none of these pads before. And I got all of them as pictured and I started with the postpartum. So let's go back a little bit before I go officially forward. So when it comes to the postpartum pads, after you have a baby, if you've had a baby vaginally, your yoni is very sore. Your yoni is swollen. You don't want nothing touching. It's nothing on it, okay? You want some cold cold pads cold you know ice all that you want just your area to be nice and cool because any dryness any friction is not going to feel good it's going to hurt it's going to cause discomfort so the great thing about these postpartum pads would be that you can put them in the freezer you know and when you're ready to use them you can take them out but i didn't do that when i had my son i took my pads to the hospital with me 
and I started using them right away. And one thing I noticed is that cool tingling sensation in your yoni. And I said, ooh, what is this? And it's like that every single time. So every single time you change your pad and you put it on, you get that cool tingling sensation, but you feel fresh down there. Okay, it's fresh and it actually feels really good, especially if you just had a baby. Um, I change my pads quite frequently, clearly because I just had a baby. So I wasn't too sure how much it would hold, you know, until a week or so after I had my son. So since I still had my flow a week later and it took a while for me, my flow to stop, I was able to get in the gist of trying out all of these pads. So one thing I can say about all of the pads is that they have that cool sensation, which is what I love. It takes time to get used to because, you know, if you're wearing uh, always brand pads, for instance, they have no cooling sensation. It's just you put the pad on and that's it. And then after a while, it may get dry or whatever. It just feels uncomfortable. With these, they're thinner, yes, but they always give that cool sensation. And do they hold a lot of flow? Yes, if you're wondering, they do hold a lot of flow, which is something I love. Even a month after having my son, I tried the postpartum ones and they do hold a lot. Not only do they hold a lot, but also the overnight holds a lot. Now, what I like about the overnight is that they're very long. So like I was saying, they're 33 centimeters. So they really go back there past your yoni and give, you know, you that that full protection because if you have a heavy flow, the last thing you want is to be leaking and having your pad overflow. And then, you you know, you're just having to change your pants and all that. You don't want to do that. You want to be able to go to sleep knowing, okay, I'm good. I'm secure. My yoni is good. And whatever layer I have on my bed will be good as well. So these postpartum pads and the overnight does an amazing job of holding the flow. The supers. Like I was saying earlier, it is 20 centimeters, 28 centimeters in length. It is shorter. However, they are thicker. And that's something that I was surprised about because the overnight and the postpartum are thinner, but the super is thicker. Got it? Okay, super. But I really thought that the overnight and the postpartum would be thicker, especially if you just had a baby, you know, your flow is flowing okay so that's what i want to say about that all of the pads feel the same they provide that soothing tingling feel i really have no complaints about that whatsoever so where you can purchase these you can purchase these at target but every time i go to target they don't have the ones i'm looking for they may not have any at all because they're always sold out because they're that great and even on the website like a lot of the i've never bought these pads from the website i bought these pads from walmart online two-day shipping get yourself into walmart.com and order some honey pot pads every time i go into target they run out they don't have or they're sold out or they just have one packaging, you know, and that's it. Every time I go to the website, they don't have what I'm looking for. So Walmart, Walmart, <laughs> um, that is where I get my pads from. Uh, let's see. What else can I say? Pads are not the only thing that the Honey Pot pad sells. They have um, actual feminine washes. And they have an array of different um, products for your yoni. I believe they also have tampons and they also have uh, wipes as well. But I haven't tried that. The only thing I've tried from the Honey Pop pad so far is just the pads. I used to be a tampon kind of girl. I'm not a tampon kind of girl anymore. The pads do the job for me. So it is what it is. I would say make sure that you check out the Honey Pot pads. Make sure that you check out the website. Make sure that you check out their reviews. But again, remember, a review is someone's experience. Just because someone had a great experience doesn't mean you will have one. And just because someone had a terrible experience means that you're going to have a terrible one. 
you always have to make sure that you know you take into consideration what people are saying but you will not know if a product works for you unless you try it out so with that being said i really hope that you took away something from this video i really enjoy these pads i'm never gonna go back to always knowing that these pads have clean ingredients ingredients i can read speaking personally after i had my baby the postpartum pads are where it's at they feel so good on your yoni if you had a baby vaginally you will not be disappointed okay you won't have to put ice down there you'll be good trust me so again with that being said um i hope that you enjoyed this video i hope that you took away something from this video i feel like going natural in every aspect of your life is the way to go do i have some work left on getting rid of some products i have and use of course i do but one step at a time with that being said peace love positive vibes drop your comments down below if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and share it with your family and your friends peace and love positive vibes always